Neville Goddard, without a doubt, has been a major influence on my manifestation journey and of millions of other people all over the world. Neville was a man way ahead of his time. He touched upon ideas and insights that science has only begun to understand today. Neville's special emphasis on human imagination is phenomenal. All his lectures and teachings touch on the subject of the wonderful human imagination and its importance in how one's life path unfolds. Learning about Neville and then putting his teachings into practice has been an amazing adventure for me. I have achieved way more than I could ever want just by using his teachings. This is why I started this channel. My purpose is to educate you people about Neville and tell you the tricks and techniques that have helped me so much in my life. But I am aware of the fact that many of you are complete beginners at this knowledge. Perhaps it's the very first time you are listening to Neville's teachings, so absorbing and understanding everything might be a daunting task for you. I was once at your place, and what helped me was listening to Neville's lectures. You can read them or even listen to them. They are available all over the internet. So, today I would like to guide you on how to start with Neville's work and in which order to read his lectures. The first lecture you must listen to is Feeling is the Secret. This one is my absolute favorite, and I can never stop recommending it to others. You can listen to the audiobook I made for this book on my channel. Just click on the pinned comment of this video to watch it later. If you know anything about Neville, you would know how big he was on the concept of feeling. Neville Goddard taught us that we can have be or acquire anything we want just by assuming the feeling of having it. Our feelings are our magic wand for creation. Still, it's a pity how so few people actually know about the power of their feelings and use them wisely. The majority of the population uses their feelings in a manipulative or negative way, and that's the only reason why they never get to their desired state. Neville says, be careful of your moods and feelings, for there is an unbroken connection between your feelings and your visible world. Your body is an emotional filter and bears the unmistakable marks of your prevalent emotions. Apart from educating you about your feelings, this lecture will also tell you about your subconscious mind and the important role it plays in your manifestations. Also, you will find ample information about the art of prayer in this lecture by Neville Goddard. The way most of us pray, from a state of lack and wanting, is totally against the original idea and essence of prayer. Prayer is not asking for something. It rather is being one with what you want. This is just a little summary of what I understood. If you will pick up this lecture, you will get to understand much more than this. Also, this one lecture will significantly impact your perspective on attaining the things you desire in life. The second book or lecture I would strongly urge you to go through is Law and the Promise. This book is full of nuggets of wisdom and easy-to-follow teachings. I remember the first time I started reading it, I couldn't put it down. There is so much interesting and useful content that you want to devour it all in a single sitting. Also, if you are a person who gets excited and motivated by success stories, then this book is definitely for you. It is full of so many amazing success stories that strengthen your belief in the law of assumption and your own power to create the life you want. When you read about other people manifesting their heart's desires, you start thinking of the same possibilities for yourself, and this book does a great job of that. Apart from the success stories, this book also has so many practical tips and teachings that you can put to use without wasting any time. If you are a complete beginner, this is the kind of material you would want to read at the start so that all the important concepts are drilled down in your mind. So, here I would like to tell you something about Neville and his teachings. A lot of Neville's books and lectures include a lot of biblical references that might be difficult to digest for so many people. Others might just be put off by the use of religious references. This is why the books that I am suggesting to you in this video have no or very few such references. In other books of Neville, you will find a lot of references that might make it hard for you to understand what Neville is trying to convey. So stick to the books I am suggesting to you and you won't face any problems. Okay, time to tell you about the third book. It is The Power of Awareness by Neville Goddard, yet another masterpiece by Neville Goddard with easy-to-understand and easy-to-apply teachings. This book tells you about the exact steps you need to take to start creating your own reality. The content is quite practical, so you won't get bored in the middle of the book. All three of these books will be a powerful introduction to Neville Goddard's work.
Read his books again and again so that you absorb and fully comprehend what he is trying to teach you. If you are brave enough to put your heart and energy into Neville's work, then I can promise you that your life will change. Because you will discover the secrets to manifesting your deepest desires that you never found anywhere else. Your perspective on your life and your circumstances will change. You will feel like you are the master of your own life, and creating new states and experiences will become effortless for you. The next step in your successful manifestation journey is to keep watching my channel. Click now on the video on the screen to be inspired by another video.